new season, new beginnings for both the Powers and today's host Dundee United, but we find ourselves back where it finished with the Powers at the end of last season. Crossing the divide between East End Park and Tannadice this summer, we had Nicky Clark, Dunfermline's top scorer in the last two seasons, Fraser Aird, a player much loved by Powers fans up until his change into Tangent and Colours, and the only change going our way was defender Mark Dunnan, formerly managed by current Powers boss Alan Johnson at Clear the South. The record that the five side carry into this fixture is well documented, now standing at no wins in the past 15 games when facing up against the Arabs. Dunfermline have all to fight for in this one, set a marker down early and see off a promotion challenger, United have the pressure on in front of a home crowd at Tannadice. Bring on the action! On one hand, if I win, I'll be ecstatic and you'll know we'll be the swell of my face for the rest of the week, probably. On the other hand, if we lose, you'll probably never see a more upset man in the next week or so because I'll be absolutely gutted. I feel like this is the ideal chance for us to win. Let's see what happens. On the pass. Right, we're parked up near Eastern Park the now. We're waiting at the supporters bus, obviously, to go to Dundee United away, but I'll pick my team the now. I'm probably going to go with a similar team to what played Saturday, but with slight changes just due to who played on Saturday, but here it goes. In goals, Lee Robinson, back three of Ashcroft, Devine and Dunnan. Wing backs, Longridge and James Cragen, because obviously Ryan Williamson is suspended. Middle three, the same as what it was on Saturday, Joe Thompson, Louis Longridge and James Vincent and up front Faisal Batuwe and Miles Hippolyte. Obviously Callum Higginbotham suspended as well so even if I wanted to put him in the team I couldn't just simply due to the fact he can't play. So aye that would be my team. The only change is Robinson in for Cammy Gill because Robinson is the first team goalie no matter how well Cammy Gill would have done on Saturday Robinson was probably always going to be picked for this game in my opinion so there's my team.
shite! Go on! Go on! Oh! Somebody get in there! Go on, Joe! Go on, Joe!
best way that we could have possibly done it. The score actually ended up kind of flat under the United a bit. In the second half, we really picked up our game and, I don't know, it just clicked. And it's so pleasing that we've finally got the win there. And we deserved it. Every player played out of their skin. The only solid down point was Lee Robinson's kind of distribution throughout the game. But apart from that, we were solid throughout the game and I thought we well deserved our win. Of course, Nicky Clark and Fraser had got in on the axe with their goals, etc. But we came out on top in the end and that's all that matters. I'm so glad it's the perfect start to the league campaign and bring on the rest of the games now, I say. We look so good this season and that can only stand us in good stead for the rest of the league campaign. That's it for this video guys, cheers for watching. If you did enjoy it, please give it a like, subscribe for more of this type of content and comment down below what you think of the game, what you think of the result, etc. But aye, until the next one, I'll see you then. Cheers guys.